Hey guys, Josh Gal here with more Mega Man 4. I totally did not forget to record this last week. Okay, maybe I totally did. But anyway, that doesn't matter because we're back with more. And uh, so if you don't remember, what happened last time was we defeated... Who did we defeat? Even See, even I don't remember. No, it was like Ring Man and Dust Man last episode, so we're ready to head on to Skull Man this episode. Now, Skull Man is just weird. <laughs> what does a Skull Man do? I mean... What, like, even, even if Skull Man wasn't made to do something, what, what kind of weapons would a skull have, like, skull-type weapons? Well, <laughs> I guess we'll see when we get up to him. No, well, he, th he, like, throws these bones. It's just, it's just stupid. It's like, what is this, Halloween or something? I was gonna say, that was actually recently, but no, that was, like, it was, like, over a month ago now, so, kind of a while ago. But, uh, Halloween isn't really a thing here, like, like, it is a thing, because of, you know, American TV syndication and all that crap, but, um, yeah, I don't think we got a single trick-or-treater this year, so, not really much a thing, which I can't really complain about, because, you know, well, when I was a kid, I still went Halloween-ing, trick-or-treating, whatever, uh, a bit, <laughs> all, I did, all I did was, like, put this mask thing on, as a zom and I was, like, a zombie, I guess. <laughs> I did like every year because like screw getting another costume no one it's like no one even remembers because again like it's not much of a thing so it's like oh it's Halloween Ugh. and like half the houses didn't even have candy to give you well they sort of did I don't remember it too well so yeah um no I don't want health Eddie by the way just a quick mention uh, our health and e-tanks might be off because uh, I practiced today and um <laughs> I forgot to like save states, so I kind of had to like replay where we were up to. So, dude, stop giving. Yeah, I'll, I'll take it. Life, whatever. So yeah, my life count and E tank count might be off. So um, you don't actually have to go to the right here, but I might as well show it off real quick. Uh, stupid shield, dude. Oh, actually, that was that was totally worth coming over here just for that. <laughs> lives everywhere. This, this, these later Mega Man's just have so many lives. It's like you can't die. Yeah, so you come over here, grab this wall. That don't respawn on me, you jackass. And there's life up there if you want it, but that's pretty much it. It's just a dead end with items, and items are good. <laughs> and so are respawning dudes. No more respawning. Okay. Anyway, let's keep going up, up and away. By the way, I just totally noticed it's like dinosaur bones in the wall. <laughs> That's funny, I can imagine them like excavate, excavating and being all like, oh, this is dinosaur, dinosaur, I can't pronounce anything today. <laughs> just dinosaur bones in the wall, man, who cares about those, just leave them there. It's not like, you know, we can do anything with those or anything, because they're just bones. Now, uh, I was going to use balloon, but I'm pretty sure you can do this without it. Yeah, there you go, see? Skill. I'll grab me some E-Tank. And then go back. And now, don't touch my caterpillar. Um, can I get back? Yes, I can. Okay. Now, uh, yeah, th these things just fall down everywhere. So, like, nope. I saw you coming. You can't get me. And what are they? Caterpillars or millipedes or centipedes? Ooh, they could be either or all of the above. So these skeleton dudes. I don't think I've mentioned this. In fact, I'm pretty sure I haven't. But you actually need to hit them with a charge shot. If you hit them with like a pea shot like that, they just like kind of fall apart and then go back together and that doesn't like, you can't like damage them over time like that so you kinda gotta just one charge shot to the face. And another life, wow, it's so generous game, I have like so many lives, six, six lives to own this boss. Now this is Skullman, ah oh, Skullman's pattern is weird, alright let me see if I can't explain it. Yeah and by the way, I don't think I've commented this but the life, the freaking help life go up counter is so slow in this game. Okay, so that's... Alright, and don't do what I'm doing now, because this is just shit. Okay, I'm going to E-Tank, and we're paying attention. Okay, so when he does this shot thing, he actually aims at you, so you want to get him to shoot every second one in the air to make it much easier to dodge. And when he puts up the shield, when he drops it, he's going to rush you, so you jump over him once he does. And I'm, see, I'm no good at getting him to aim the shots properly. So he just randomly puts up the shield, because I guess... That's his weapon, you know, so he kind of has to use it, because that makes sense. But yeah, um, I know that, that was pretty shit, but uh, 
I was never really good at him. And, you know, even if I was using his weakness, it wouldn't help because it's pretty much the same thing. It's just maybe he dies a bit quicker. I don't know. But anyway. Oh, yeah. What? I love the screen. <laughs> it's like his head rotates. I can't imagine them having to, like, draw that from every angle. That'd be so annoying. But, oh, well. I didn't... I've got what, lots of weapons to show off, haven't I? I've been kind of lazy with that. <laughs> okay, um, dive man, drill man, um, wait, what? <laughs> Which one do I do next? Uh, dive man. Wait, what's strong against dive man? Dive man, right? Skull shield is strong against dive man. So I was actually gonna do drill man next, but screw it, we'll do dive man. Dive Man has a pretty cool stage in this game. Lots of water, lots of stuff going up and down. It's pretty cool. Oh, and the music's badass, but of course, it's Mega Man. What do you expect? Okay, so what haven't I shown off yet? Uh, did I show off Pharaoh? I don't remember at all. So Skull is pretty much just a generic shield. Like, you know, we've seen that before. Uh, Bright, Bright, I believe I already showed that off. It just, like, freezes the screen, like Flash Man. Toad, yeah, Pharaoh, Ring. Ring is, like... Um, Shadow Man's weapon in Mega Man 3, really useless. And Dust Dust just throws a cube, it's like nothing special at all. And Pharaoh Far is pretty cool though, you can actually charge it up, and it's like this giant ball, and if stuff runs into that ball, it'll get hurt, and you can also like throw it, so... Yeah, but um... You, you may notice in Mega Man 4... Uh, what, what number is this? <laughs> in Mega Man 4... Five and six, the weapons start getting a bit like useless. I want to say because because you can just charge up the Buster, which I should stop doing by the way. <laughs> so it's like, well, why would I switch to like this weapon which has ammunition when I can just like use the Buster, which the Buster is like the coolest e either way. So it's like <laughs> it's a win-win. Here's a whale, which I've, I have no clue how to dodge this guy's shit. You just you, I just shoot and win. It's like, how are you supposed to dodge that? It moves so quick. Maybe you're supposed to, like, charge shot it and blow it up. I don't know. <laughs> All I know is that stuff needs to die. Like me, because my health is getting really low. That did not help. <laughs> uh, I think Eddie's coming up. I could use... Yeah, he's right here, actually. Give me some health, bro. No, I don't want to lie. <laughs> Fuck it, I'll take it. I was using Ease Hank. Why not, right? And it's not like I wasn't going to use these things anywhere else. Jeez, one thing about Mega Man 4, your health and enemies' bosses' health goes up so slow. I don't know what that was all about. Like, who who at Capcom was like, hey, you know that boss health and that? That just goes up way too slow. I ain't fast. We need to slow that shit down to uh, make it really annoying. And they're just like, yeah, okay, we'll do that. <laughs> and I guess they realized their problem in Mega Man 5, because in, like, Mega Man 5, it goes, it's, like, the fastest of any series, and then they slow it again down in 6. It's a bit all over the place, it really is. So here's a cool glitch, sort of glitch. Uh, if you use Rush Marine here, which is probably the only stage you can use it, if you like go up and hold up, you can Rush Marine in the air. So cool. <laughs> but uh, not really useful. In fact, Rush Marine is just not useful at all in this game. Yeah, like I just said, this is like the only stage you can use it in, so it's like, not as useful. Oh, I hate these whales. Oh, now he's sucking me in. What? Oh, why did I take so much damage on that? These whales. And I'm just going to fight him again, because looky here, if you fall down this hole here, and you keep falling, and you keep falling, and, uh, oh, I had, I had to move there. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> There's actually the second and last hidden upgrade down here, which uh, is totally missable. And is it's probably, it's nowhere near as useless as, useful, I wanted to say. <laughs> nowhere near as useful as the balloon. It's kind of crap, actually. It's this wire. Now, if anything, it looks cool as shit, though. It's like he's, Mega Man is now, like, Bionic Commando or something, and he can, like, wire himself on things. But, uh, yeah, there is, like, so little places where it can actually be used. And even if you can, you can probably just use, like, Balloon or Rush Jet to get up there. So, it's not even needed. Oh, look, that refilled my health, actually. Wow, I should... That's good. I like that. <laughs> Alright, jump over this shit. 
freaking manta ray robots. Why why is there a manta ray robot? That doesn't make any sense. Hang on, can I like use Bright Man to freeze this guy? Yes I can. So that Alright, there's a strategy for you kids. Use Bright Man as a weapon, because you can freeze the whales and take no damage. Or at least minimal damage. Anyway. So I don't think this level has that much longer left. I think it's just just this one more screen and you've got these like bomb things which blow up. Oh, I didn't even see that guy. Water goes up and down. This is a weird stage. You know, of all the water stages, I this is probably the most forgetful one. Uh, there's another one in five, but the one in five, oh, don't you dare. Are you fucking kidding me with this? <sighs> As I was saying, <laughs> there's another one in five, but the, the water stage in Mega Man 5 is so memorable, and I guess you'll see why when I get up to that game, which uh, might actually be a while, because man, these stages just take longer and longer to do. Like Mega Man 2, like it's like Flash Man, we could get through that in like minutes, but the stages in this just take longer and longer, and um, I suppose that's a good thing, but for LPing's sake, this is just gonna make these games go for a while, like, I still don't think a single game will go over 10 episodes though, which is um, pretty good, because <laughs> You know, I'm only doing this series on the weekends, it's getting a very low amount of updates. Heck, it'll go for ages, which is good, because I won't have to replace it with anything. Actually, I was considering doing something. Because, um... Because once, um, once, like, oh, yeah, I did the fucking same thing! No, don't open that! Fuck off! <laughs> this game is the best. I love this game. <laughs> No, if I, if I, I could actually tell you which I rank these games in order now. What was I? No, before I do that, I should finish my previous discussion. Okay, um, right. Thing, yeah. So once, once this Mega Man crap wraps up, it's not crap, it's really cool, I like these games. But once it wraps up, and um, the Pokemon thing will be continued after that, and um, yeah, if Pokemon is not going anywhere, I like that game. It's like, third gen is my favorite gen, and you know, the remix just came out, so I'm enjoying playing those. I still hate the experience share, how that works, but that's a that's a whole nother story for another time. Like, gee, pretty good games. Uh, if you've got a 3DS, I definitely recommend them. But if you've got a 3DS, you've probably already been considering it or already have Pokemon because that's kind of the system seller. So I didn't do it that time. Pro memory skills, not actually terrible memory skills. Yeah. So anyway, I was thinking of once that's all done. Instead of having, like, a second LP going on, like me and Brandon could get some verses going or something, I don't know. Just tossing around ideas. Because I kind of like having a second thing to go to, but I think, like, two episodes is maybe too many, so maybe only one a week, I don't know. Anyway, I don't know why I paused the screen, because it's not like I'm switching weapons. So this is Dive Man, I think? Man, there's just they're, the Robot Master's names are so unmemorable at this point. But unlike his pattern, I remember his pattern really easy because he has a really simple one. He just uh, shoots missiles and he rushes you. That's all he does. So the the only problem with fighting this guy is you've got to like be able to tell when he's going to start shooting missiles at you and when he's going to um, dash. And there's really no tell, so. The, it's just experience whether you do good or not with this guy. As you can see, I did not do too good. So, uh... <laughs> unfortunately. Anyway, let's try again. That was a nice mouth there, by the way, guy. His weakness doesn't make him any easier. Well, he does, technically, but what I mean is that it, it's pretty much the same... Fuck off, man, I suck today. <laughs> Go on, I pr didn't I practice? Not really. I mean, I played it a bit. I didn't really practice though because I could only you can only have like one save state. So if I wanted to practice that robot master in particular, I'd have to die on it. So I didn't. Well, yeah, I wasn't like. Ugh. Overall, I probably should have practiced more. But that's uh, fuck. <laughs> this guy does a lot of damage. Can I just say that? It's like even if you you take like a couple of hits, you die. And I could I could use his weakness, but I'd rather not. I'd rather keep trying. Bloody robot masters and their bloody open mouths. Alright, super serious time. Rushing. Rushing. 
rushing. Uh, the problem is, the thing you gotta do is not jump as high. But if you fuck it up, you got like these missiles going at you and it's not easy to recuperate. Alright, just don't fucking jump too high. It's so easy to fucking forget. Well, it's easier with his weakness. No, didn't I just go saying it wasn't? I took like three hits. What the hell? Maybe it wasn't three hits. Good thing I got like 50 lives. I don't I I'm I don't know what's going on, guys. I swear it did not take me this many times to kill him before. Something's something's up. Did I turn on super hard difficulty or something? <laughs> maybe I did. Mm, maybe. Hmm. Yeah, it's, you're like four hits against this guy. That's. Oh, I see. What, no, he does more damage when he rushes you. I've got no E tanks. I have no E tanks. Wow. Wow. You know, for the record, I've actually never done this bad against this guy. I don't know what's going on. But I'm not. I'm not giving up. I could just use his weakness, but I'm not doing that because that's wussy and I'm gonna do this yeah like I said the problem is if you if you can't tell that he's shooting missiles and then you let a few get astray and then he like he rushes towards you that's like it's fucking ugh, it's just fucking off fuck off he is really hauling my ass I'm not gonna get game over am I I don't think I've got that many lives left this is terrible <laughs> okay I got one left. Gee, it looks. I guess I really did, did need all those lives. This is crazy. All right, you've met your maker this time. Shooting missiles. Okay. So yeah, the goal when he shoots missiles is not to bloody shoot him. It's just to get the missiles out. So that's not a problem. You see, you see. See, I can actually concentrate when I shut up. <laughs> Unfortunately, shutting up is hard to do. Mmm, <laughs> indeed. <laughs> Alright, get out of here. This is embarrassing moment number fi five of this LP. <laughs> you got dive missile. Right, did I, did I, I don't, I don't think so. I think I might not have. <laughs> Thanks for telling me, I had no idea. Anyway, we've only got one left, Drill Man, but unfortunately, because of that crazy fail whale trail, uh, we ran out of time. Well, we probably would have anyway. But anyway, Drill Man is nowhere near as hard. I don't know. Dive Man is not hard. It's just, if he gets you, he gets you. You have to pay full attention the whole thing so he doesn't fuck you over, because he kills you in like, you saw that. If he hits you with the... Um, like the spinny attack thing he does, that does a shit ton of damage to you, so yeah, gotta be careful. But anyway, see you next time for Drill Man. Take care till then.